In this video we're going to talk about how to solve gimbal lock inside of 3D Studio Max. Um, I recently came across this problem and it was really frustrating trying to find the solution but after I reached out to my college instructor on this issue I was able to find the solution and I'm going to share that with you guys now. So basically what gimbal lock is is when you're animating um, an object and you put a rotation on that object it can sometimes act really strange on the axes and to illustrate that what I have is this uh, four-sided quad right here and I've linked these other four-sided quads to it and I'm going to animate these maybe at a 90 degree angle to kind of illustrate what I'm doing and how to solve the problem okay so as you can see everything's highlighted and I only have keyframes on this um, this object right here and what I want to do now is go ahead and do hit turn on auto key and hit let's start with this one and we're gonna hit a rotation on here and this one we're gonna add a keyframe and move a little bit further down the line and then we're gonna do a 90 degree actually let me undo that and click on my angle snap toggle and we're gonna go to 90 degrees and then we're gonna scrub through that and that seems to work fine okay now the problem is some of our objects that maybe have a different axes, um, maybe it's an axis that's uh, the same as our angle, and when we want to do a rotation on that one, we will move down the timeline a little further and just rotate 90 degrees on here. And now you're going to see what's happening with gimbal lock. We're getting this really strange rotation and even though I moved it only on that one axis, the Y axis, I'm getting this really strange rotation. So how do we fix that? How do we fix that in 3D Studio Max? So here's the quickest solution to that. And I'm going to move this right into that keyframe so you can see exactly what happens. So it's going to be up here on your right on the Motion tab. So let's go ahead and click on that. And right here where we have the Transform Position, if you go down to Rotate Position and you highlight that, and then go right up here to assign controller you just click on that and by default 3ds max is going to use the Euler uh, XYZ and you just want to click on TBC rotation and hit OK and instantly that's going to snap that back into place and when we scrub through our animation that solves our gimbal lock so there's a quick answer to gimbal lock inside of 3d studio max I hope this helps thanks